Welcome back to Sarge Collect. Today I will be unboxing this beachhead. I got this beachhead for my wife. Um, while she was out at Target, she decided to uh, text me and let me know, hey, there's a beachhead here at Target. So I told her to go get it for me and uh, yeah, I'm excited. So let's go ahead to uh, unboxing this beachhead figure. Okay, here we go. This is the retro carded beachhead. Look at that paint. Look at that artwork. Pretty cool. Now this is what I remember about beachhead. You know, when uh, back in the 80s, the three and three quarter uh, figure. So cool. I got that guy, got that guy, and I got that guy. I actually got three of these guys and three of these guys by accident because I completely forgot that I had ordered a couple of them. And, uh, yeah, that's how I ended up having army builders for the snow serpent and the cobra eel. But Beachhead, this is his file card. Wayne R. Sneeden, his ranger, primary specialty, infantry, secondary specialty, small arms armor. He's from Auburn, Alabama. Let's get this guy open. All right, so I got this guy opened up. Oh, jeez. I didn't quite cut him up yet. I got to cut the bottom. There you go. All these retro carded figures, they come with a stand. So there's that stand. This figure looks pretty cool. All right, let's get him out of this thing. Now I got the other beachhead, the classified. Um, I don't remember what number he is, but I didn't quite like that beachhead. I don't know. People are mixed. You know, some people like this beachhead. Some people like the other beachhead. But to me, this reminds me of the beachhead I know growing up. Kind of wish he had uh, the beret though. He's got the beret there. And as always, I hate these plastic things. Okay. This is your beachhead. See his T pose. Pretty smooth. I like it. Pretty smooth T-pose, head articulation, that is as far as it will go, down, okay, what about this butterfly shoulder, does he have any, okay, butterfly shoulder, that's about as far as it go. Not very far back or forward. Ab crunch. I'm not sure if he can do ab crunch with this guy because of his vest. Which I think looks pretty cool. Looks nicely detailed. Now he's got his beret there. Kind of wish he had an actual beret. You know, it looks like I'm about to get the beret out of the G.I. Joe classified beachhead. Drop down hips. It's a little stiff, but it goes. Torso. Okay, not bad. What about the elbows? I've al I'm always afraid of these elbows here that they might snap right off. They're like, really hard to bend sometimes. Okay. Die cut, does he have die cut? Yeah, but a little stiff. A little stiff. Knees. Double jointed knees right there, boom. You got your ankle rocker there. What about his boot cut, ow! <laughs> That pinched me. 
Um, okay, he's got his boot cut. Ooh, that one's tough. Oh, ooh, boy, that one's tough. Yep, there we go. That one was a doozy. That's a tough one. Matt's warm that bad boy up, okay. Definitely got to warm that up. Okay, yeah, I'm not going to force it. That is stuck. So put them in uh, some warm water. If that doesn't work, do the heating method. All right, let's stand up beachhead. Put them on your stand. You know, these things come with stands. I'm going to utilize a stand. Which way do you guys know we do the stand? This way or this way? No, it's got to be this way. Yeah, it's got to be that way. There we go. Stand this guy up right there. Beachhead. All right, let's check out what he's got in his box, in his arsenal. Got his backpack. Again, if I have the time, which I should try to make some time, it's like I, I want to paint some detail in some of these bag, uh, backpacks because I hate having just a solid color backpack. For instance, we should paint a little bit of that, you know? I don't know. Is that a rocket? What is this, actually? Do you guys know? Uh, yeah, just paint some, you know, or give some highlights or something. But that would be one day. Got this. Crossbow. Oh, man, look at that. Wow. Okay, somewhat fixed, but yeah, that thing was quite bent. Got comes with this. That's kind of weird. Now, I'm not a. Gun enthusiast where I know every the name of each weapon here, but what is this supposed to be? Like a silencer? Kinda looks weird. I've never seen silencers like that. It comes with these grenades or smoke bombs. Flashbangs. And he comes with two knives. A green handle and a black handle. Um, oh, okay. I was like wondering what happened to the other uh, sheath for his knife. I'm going to think this one goes here. Right? Since the blade looks bigger, then this one goes at the bottom. Got his two knives right there. Put his backpack on. Okay, not bad. Usually I have trouble getting the backpacks on. With this one, it went on pretty, pretty nicely. It fits and it's not falling off. I'm somewhat tugging it and it's in there. I want to take this off. I don't know about that one. Put his pistol right here. I'm going to assume this goes right in there. And then his... Again, I'm right-handed, so a lot of my figures are also going to be right-handed. What do you guys do? Do you make your figures right-handed or left-handed? Oh man, this guy looks great. 
definitely have some good photo ops for this dude. Just gotta warm up that leg though. There's your beach head. Oh, I completely forgot about this one. Oh man. Look at this. Almost forgot about this. Put that around his shoulder. There you go. Ready to go. Ready to rock and roll. Beachhead. This is an awesome looking figure. What do you guys think? Do you guys like Beachhead? I think he's sweet. Backpack. He's got his firearm. Um, yeah. Now again, I just wish that they they did have a beret, a, a loose beret, so that way we can actually put him on on his head there. It's all right. I'm gonna eventually open up the classified beach head one day. But there you go. What do you guys think? You guys see all the uh, friends, all the enemies up there you got carnage metalhead the dreadnoughts and you got your kingpin right over there in the background they about to have a party all right again thanks for watching this is a quick video of beachhead make sure you guys comment like and subscribe to sarge collects i mainly collect gi joe's and some Marvel Legends, but not much anymore. Have a great day.